Guys, it's 7 a.m. and I'm awake and dressed. <laughs> Well, that was my actual alarm. The one that I usually snooze and then have another hour in bed. But instead, I'm awake. Right, I'm not being funny, but it's a Saturday. What, why did my brain choose a Saturday where it's throwing it down to be like, you ain't getting no sleep because of me. Sleep because of y'all. Y'all not gonna get sleep because of me. When I need to get up, when I have a module, you know, that I have to arrive on time to. My bed is the nicest place I have ever been. If you're new here, my name is Rosie and I am a master's student studying forensic archaeology and anthropology. Today's a weekend, as I've already said, and therefore I have nothing to, to do. Wow! The land of make-believe! No, that's a lie. Rosie, you have a dissertation and a module next week whereby you have to stand in front of your entire class and defend your evidence. Jesus. Oh, Jesus, Mary and Joseph. I've got a feeling that's why I'm awake. My body was like, hell no, nah, you're getting sh done today. As I said, I have my courtroom skills module next week. That, did I just say mid, 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 mid. I have my courtroom skills module next week and in that module we have to prepare an expert witness statement that I've already submitted and I was a lead forensic archaeologist in that witness statement. We have the courtroom bit next week and we have to stand up in front of everyone and first defend our own statement so we get cross-examined and then we do the cross-examining on a different case and then we also, so that's counsel for the prosecution and then I, we're like chief something for the defence. This is why I need to work on it. I've done a lot of work for it, but for someone who's never done like criminology or law before, I'm, I'm gonna need to work on it. You know what, maybe I could have some more sleep? No. I'm going to fill up my beautiful Blue. water bottle. That's old. It's actually vile outside. Ew. <laughs> I splashed out. I really never thought I'd be one of these people. <sighs> this is my second coffee. I've already had one today. I, that's what second means. Well, I'll tell you what, Sherlock Holmes. Okay, I just wanted to show you my apples. What up? I'm Jared. I'm 19. There's so many. Have you seen the state of her body? Right, I am gonna start a tree because it's now quarter to nine. I'm not entirely sure how I've been procrastinating eating my breakfast that long, considering I was hungry an hour ago, but we're we gonna grow a tree and then, then I will just get on with stuff. Two hour sunflower. <laughs> For the last just over an hour, I have been basically ripping someone else's expert witness statement to shreds. I feel so mean. So <laughs> we have to cross-examine someone from the cross the pro the prosecution as a defence lawyer, basically. No, I'm not doing law, but I, it's just so that they know we have like a full understanding of one, how the process works in court and two, what is wrong with statements, like what you can be pulled for in court, what doesn't stand up as evidence, um, how you can jeopardize your own evidence's integrity by like leaving things out or doing things wrong in a certain way. And I just feel so mean. We're meant to come up with a few questions 
basically just to try and undermine the statement as much as possible. I currently have 13. I'm not sure how many questions we're meant to have. We get 14 to 15 minutes, very exact, to do our cross-examination. And hopefully I can fit all of these things in because I think they're good questions. I'm gonna have to apologize to this person big time afterwards. I've never actually even spoken to them in real life. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but um, I mean, this is literally what we're meant to do. That's the whole point. Someone's gonna do it to me as well. So I need to, this afternoon, oh, it's only 10 o'clock. God, get, 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 I think I might have just had an aneurysm. I need to go through my own statement. I basically rip my own to shreds so that I've got a response to anything that someone throws at me. I did just have a break, but there's still 43 minutes left of my sunflower. So I'm gonna get back on with this and I guess I'll see you at 10.43 a.m. When it may be an acceptable time for a nap. Nope. Iced tea imported from England. Lifeguards imported from Spain. You don't import people. That, that is trafficking. Getting ripped tonight, all right. Tell me you believe in love, cause it's not an illusion to me. I've had Weetabix and two coffees before 10.30 and I've never wanted a nap more. Am I broken? Hello, and welcome to an episode of Rosie Makes Her Bed so she doesn't get back into it for a nap. I'm also gonna tidy up my sort of clean pile. Hi, my camera died and now it's lunchtime. To be more specific, it's 12.44 p.m. and I've spent the last 20 minutes trying to work out what I'm gonna eat and I still haven't decided. I'm gonna put on a cheeky bit of One Direction and make my lunch and hopefully I'll be inspired. <laughs> Bloody froze my carrots! I'm not being funny. <laughs> but how? I've... I've frozen all up. They were in the. What else have I frozen? Now I have TMJ disorder. Um, if you're unaware what that is, it's tempo. Am I a forensic anthropology student or... It's temporo mandibular joint disorder, which means this joint here doesn't fit right. Um, I can't eat hard things. That's what she said! <laughs> wow, that is really hard. I can't explain my lunch really, I just fancied it. It's not very exciting at all. Mm. I forgot how much I like rice cakes and hummus. Normally during lunch I'd watch Netflix but I, <laughs> I've had like two hours off impromptu because I could have had a nap and yet I just scrolled. 
and that would have been a better use of my time. So I'm gonna do 90 minutes. Yes. Go. As fast as the seasons change, my heart was stolen. Parts of me that were broken by love. And no amount of distance can. I had a break from courtroom skills to do my dissertation for the last few hours, so I've actually been writing about disease and. Where's my f that's not my face. What? Oh, Jesus Christ. I've been looking at disease and climate change because it's remotely relevant to my dissertation and now I need to go to the gym. If I can motivate myself to go to the gym in this, I can do anything. Or maybe I'm just taking procrastination to a whole new level. I really don't want to go out there. <laughs> no, we're going, we're going, we're going. Summer and I are not currently friends. Yeah. I'm not where I'm supposed to be, and I say that she don't believe I feel it. Estranged. I travel down the coast for free. I'm going back there, hopefully, where it's warmer. Yeah, it's warmer. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Check the front, I see a checker flag. Too busy checking back, I always see a checker past. And every check I spend is one that's meant to last It's funny how you own the car but rent the gas It's sunny days ahead, yeah, I was meant for that It is 5.40pm now I've had my shower and I'm gonna have a protein shake I can't open it Oh my god I was about to denounce feminism and ask for a man's help But I don't... What man would I ask? I'm alone I'm gonna do an hour of courtroom skills now before I have my tea. It's like an hour and 15 minutes and then I'll have tea at seven. Yeah, that's a good plan, round numbers, we like those. And then after tea I need to edit because I've got a video deadline for Find a Masters on Monday. This is my last video for them, I think. My time as a Find a Masters ambassador is nearly over. Okay, I'm going to set a uh, one hour and 15 minute tree so that I focus until seven and then I'll make tea and watch TV and then edit. There it is, there we go. Plant is the final brain cell. Ba -da 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 -da. Okay. so hungry it's not even seven yet it's like 22 but i can't work anymore my brain hurts what should i eat okay i went for corn this packet of tomato and basil rice i'm gonna put this leftover fajita seasoning in there and also some lettuce i think it's gonna be yummy Yummy, 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 yummy. Ooh, yeah. Do you want to know something really sad? I bought myself a pack of crackers as like a treat snack, right? I've got crisps as well, but I love crackers. I didn't check the ingredients. They've got milk in. Well, at least I read the packet now and didn't give them myself a packed lunch because that would not have been fun in my courtroom case. I wonder if they'd just give me like my average or if I'd get zero, if I just died. 
I wonder what photo they'd use of me. Forensic student dies, med court case. Forensic student becomes forensic case, med court case. My tea is nearly ready. I've got the corn pieces in there, lettuce, rice in the micro wade, and I'm gonna put a film or a TV show on. I haven't decided. And I'm gonna get my water. This water, oh my god, oh my god. For some reason, the gym water is heavenly. So every time I leave, I refill my bottle. Woohoo, the microwave is good. Gotcha, hello, hello. Oh, it's so ready, it looks amazing. And I got a fat dollop of mayo, yes, baby. That you were so excited about. Uh, so what kind of Insta campaign were you guys thinking about? We want you. You know when people do like really nice messy buns? Couldn't be me. It's not me. It's not me. No. I'm gonna have a really productive day tomorrow. <sighs> what a day. I'm not gonna watch a film, I'm gonna watch an episode or something because I'm gonna have an early night. And do you know why I'm gonna have an early night? Because I'm maintaining a decent sleep schedule. Why you always lying? say good night I'm going to bed <laughs> it's not as early as I would have liked it to have been but I got very stuck on an online shopping rabbit hole and you know when you're just scrolling and scrolling for hours and like adding more things to your basket and then you get to your basket and the price makes you want to cry so then you get rid of everything and then you chicken out and bang anything and then it was all pointless and you should have gone to bed three hours ago no Okay guys, I'll see you in my next video. I hope you enjoyed this one, and if you did, give me a thumbs up, share, comment, you know, you know what to do. I appreciate any form of interaction, honestly, because it is genuinely nice to be able to engage with you. So if you had a favorite moment, if something made you laugh, just put it in the comments. If you wanna tell me about your day, again, put it in the comments and I will respond to you. Have a good week and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.